this training session we'll discuss strobe measurement basics. We will discuss the target area, sampling area, and reporting area. The measurement form can be obtained from the measurement icon in the strobe landing page. Here I will select a new measurement. The measurement form has now been simplified to three simple areas, target, sampling, and reporting. In the target area, the things to look at are active, I want to measure an active running application, next run, measure the next run of the process, or I can schedule the measurement that is already running or the next time through. The strobe environment allows me to select the system I want to measure from, the job process types, and the job process. Selecting the magnifying glass icon will bring me to a list of active jobs and processes. In the sampling section, this is the strobe sampling duration, number of samples, and sessions. Final session action, quit, stop, or continue. I can do an override of the sampling dataset prefix. If you are licensed for IMS and or KICS, you will then see these options displayed. They will allow you to further select sampling in these two areas. DB2 provides you a way of capturing SQL. You can override DDF requesters, provide literals, put on some filters, your license for MQ, database natural. You can also select from these. The reporting session allows you to provide the profile name. In this case, we see a suffix. That's because we added a suffix of the date to the profile name. I can select the folder or let it default to iStrobe. Provide some tags. I'll put options. I want to create this profile automatically. That way I do not have to do it in the measurement tab from Maestro. I could provide a notification email. I have DB2. I can provide some extra SQL analysis to get some explain information, catalog information, and observations. Source support allows me to provide the DDIO. Once all that information is filled, I can submit the measurement for stroke to measure. That is the end of the measurement basic training. Thank you.